All right, thank you guys so much for coming out to my big announcement. So after much prayer and consideration, I've decided it's time to re-sign as Pope. Any questions? Yes, right here. Why did you make this decision now? Health concerns, personal reasons, or do you feel like a younger Pope could lead the Catholic Church in a more inclusive and accepting direction? What? I'm asking why you decided to resign. Why are you stepping down? Oh, no. I didn't say I was going to resign. I said I'm going to re-sign. Because the other day, someone was like, hey, do you still want to be Pope? And I was like, yeah, let's restructure my Pope contract for six years, 28 million. That's not how being Pope works. It's not? Oh wait, are you like an expert in Pope law? <laughs> well, I graduated with honors from journalism school, I have a large Twitter following, and I'm a 12-year veteran of one of our nation's most prestigious newspapers. So you know literally nothing about religion? Yeah, pretty much. Whoa, cool. Hey, wait, is the reason you got all excited about the idea of me resigning because you thought it would be fun to have a new pope who could contradict a bunch of stuff I said? Yeah, that would be fun. And is the reason you think that because the idea of three living popes contradicting each other would demolish the sense of authority the Catholic Church projects to you? Yes, I would like that demolished. And do you want that demolished not because you care one way or another about the particular outward institution known as the Roman Catholic Church, but because you see the Roman Catholic Church as a visible manifestation of Christian epistemological claims and you are haunted by the terrifying possibility that Christianity is true, that Jesus is Lord, and that you are therefore under his authority? Pope Francis, what do you think of the war in Ukraine? Oh my gosh, war is bad. Do you know why war is bad? Cause people die? Man, how does everybody know that? I'm just saying, I just think it would be cool if you resigned and they got a new pope, and then he resigned in two days, and the next pope resigned in an hour, and then by Christmas, everybody has been pope. And when everybody is pope, no one will be. I feel like you could use a nap, and maybe 6,000 exorcisms. <laughs>